Hello, my name is Sergeant First Class O'Brien. I am currently the Visionist, but I used to be the Traddock Drill Sergeant Academy Brigade Commanding Officer. I've been in USAF for around two years now, and I am here for this interview. I am Krebs. I've joined USAR about seven months ago, and I am the Center for Initial Military Training Command Sergeant Major in Traddock. So, I was scrolling on YouTube and I came across the CV video. It was the, what is it called? Roblox Army Experience video. And uh, I thought, I don't know, it looked quite weird and quite funny. So uh, I, I gave it a watch and I, want, I wanted to try the experience myself. Uh, I wanted to see how strict it was. And after I passed BCT, I was hooked into you, so. I was previously in another United States Army when Initius was Tridoc Commanding General and I believe then he owned that army in 2018 and most of their members transferred to this one so when I heard about this transfer recently I, I wanted to check how things were going here and decided to join. You, you go first, Crip. I need a thing um, for me. What wardrobe change? Tradoc is very interesting. There are certain expectations that we that we want our personnel to uphold. So because of these expectations and the leadership that need, they need to represent, it's it's definitely challenging to to get. You. Oh I'm God. dead. He killed me. That's murder. No one cares. Sorry. No one cares, Owen. It's definitely challenging to maintain these expectations, but overall, it's pretty interesting and pretty that dynamic in terms of new things happening every day and not overall being the same things over and over. I find Chadok a really cool place to be because people label Chadok to be the best of the best and it really encourages you to build discipline and really form you to make your best self Okay, okay, just just carry on. I don't I don't know what to say, man. In my point of view, my personnel aren't annoying. The only thing I would call it would be challenging, since there's millions of things I can that someone can do that you wouldn't expect, and it's just how dynamic it is to work on all of these situations since they're all so different and i don't think it's annoying at all i just think it can be a little bit challenging to adapt to everyone differently yeah um so same with me i don't think it's annoying either i think my per the personnel i've had was quite great they were really you no know, they they had fun with their duties they really made my job a lot easier the main issue was people did get demotivated uh, quite often, so I did have to think of ways and I, I had to use every trick in the book to really boost the morale and try and get people to post phases and trials, so yeah. I don't work closely with them, so I wouldn't be able to to provide an opinion on how they work. From things I've heard, there are certain things that have not worked in the past administration that are working for this one. So I would say there's good feedback in that aspect. But again, I don't have a close relationship with the way they work, so I wouldn't be able to to talk about their, their duties. I think the current USA administration are quite good. I believe they have the right goals and vision for the future of USAR. Like, for example, I've heard they're planning to bring in war games, they're planning to bring in a lot of fun stuff that should motivate uh, the majority of USAR. Yeah, so overall, they're, they are quite nice, and I am looking forward to what they will bring in the future. Like, I honestly don't know. I'd have to 
think more on it. There, there hasn't been a specific command that I was like, oh, let's have this one released. I think I really want to see um, Ask Back ASCC. They were like a division that helped out army staff and they used to create propaganda for USA and they were overall just really helpful. Yeah, I thought, it, I thought that division was cool and I don't know, it, I think it would be a great addition to USA. Maybe in the future they will add it, but we'll see. It could, it could even be like a joint with the news team since they pretty much do graphics for Yeah, USA. yeah, that's, a, that that, that's cool. a good point to be honest. My most embarrassing moment was when I was Drill Sergeant Academy Sergeant Major, Brigade Sergeant Major. Oh! And then, oh yeah? And th No, wait, let me finish. <laughs> <laughs> when I was Drill Sergeant Academy Brigade Sergeant Major, and then I resigned and became Public Affairs Sergeant Major. And then three days later, I came back to TriDog. Um, basically, long story short, when I was the DES, a, like around a year ago, I was hosting like a, a PT rally in Fort Martin and I wanted to do a, a CT there. So I teamed everyone to like ASOP Force Com so we can actually kill each other. And after the event, someone reported me. I had asked Gone, the current Gone Canada, if it was all right to, you know, use the team command on private servers and he said yes. And then I screenshotted him saying that and and posted it to the person who um, reported me. I think around 30 minutes later we got like um we got a message from OIG which is basically today's MIC. It was explaining how not 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 me but Gon should get punished for allowing me to use the team command. It really made people look down on me a lot because I kind of snitched and rat gone out but it wasn't my intention to and I love Gong from the bottom of my heart, and that, that was quite embarrassing. I don't regret anything of my experience in USCR. I think I've made the right decisions, and it's been great. I've learned a bunch from my past experiences. So overall, if I were to join USCR again, I think I would uh, join the same command, do the same de decisions that I've done. Overall, I don't have any regrets. I wouldn't do anything differently. If I had to go back all over again, I don't think I would have joined Chadok as my first command because, well, I initially joined Chadok because I didn't know what the f 82nd was or ASOC. Like, I, I was completely new to this military roleplay. As Traddock was the first command I saw, I was like, oh, this is cool. Let me, let me boss you ones around. If, if I had to go back, I would probably join a saw or something. There's something really, really, like, fun and, you know, loads of things to do. And I get to join, like, parachuting events or something. And flying helicopters. I plan to become someone that that is respected and that people look up to the ways that I do certain things, uh, certain tasks. I think overall, it's more of being a person that people can look up over. Yeah, I mean, same with me to be honest. Uh, um, I, w I want to become a person that people look up to and really take inspiration off of me, like my hard work, my discipline. Oh, I would love to become army staff, but it may put a lot of stress on me and more stress that I can handle. And I'd rather let other people who can uh, do the job better than me do it. My first opinion of UCR when I joined was that it would basically be the same as when I left it, but then I realized the many changes I went through and the many good changes that I went through, more specifically. My opinions on UCR changed for the better since before it wasn't as organized as it was 
as it is now, um, more specifically in Tridoc? I think USA has changed from when I joined. It's changed a lot. There were, well, first, there, there were loads of commands that you could join, and a lot of people were more active. I think mainly because it was it, it was COVID times, so a lot of people stayed at home and they had the time to be active in USA. But, uh, but generally, I don't think it changed too much. Like how like the commands are ran, how things work in general. I really, I really do hope army staff implement new and exciting ideas, so the majority of USA can have fun and really enjoy being in USA. I will rate Sans as USCR a uh, seven out of ten. I feel like there is many things that still need to be worked on. So I'm gonna go with eight because sure there are things to work on, but compared to other armies, I think USA is the most organized, the most I don't know, the most fun for me. And yeah, it really is um, a pleasure to be serving here. Absolutely not. No, I just want to. I just want to give him company. Yeah. I'm not doing another interview. Crip has seen too much. Introduction. Yeah. Q3. Uh, excuse Q3. me. I'm having a conversation. Excuse me. Oh, in the shot. Go. Go. Hello. Where? Oh, let me stop. <laughs> in my face. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I, 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 don't, I don't know what to say. Like, we can't, we don't really specialize. Okay, right, let me restart, let me restart, let me restart. Um, <clears throat> what's it like in Tradoc? Oh. Tradoc? <laughs> I'll start again. Yeah. <laughs> god, and, 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 What's it like in Chadok? Great dog shit, MPC is great. You just sound like one of them call centers guys right there. Say it again, Shadow, that's <laughs> Oh, let me restart. <sighs> I don't know why I'm so nervous. Bro, you're good. Maybe more army stuff. I'm gonna actually jump off a cliff, Kurt. Oh my god. <laughs> One more time, one more time, one more time. It's just a Roblox interview. Just yeah, no, I know, I know, I know, it's just... Wait, where the f*** did break. Crap go? Oh, yeah, like... Crap, where did you go? Can you just loop the video? Oh, wow, lazy. <laughs> 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 